Well, hello there everyone and welcome to Time to Cook. I'm Chef Christy. So today I have another bread recipe to share with you. And this is super easy. It only uses three ingredients. I love recipes with just a few ingredients. So what I'm making today is a beer bread. And like I said, this is so easy to make. You cannot mess this up. There's no kneading, there's no waiting for the dough to rise. You just combine the ingredients, pour it into a loaf pan, put it into your oven, let it bake, and then before you know it, you have a delicious bread. So all you're going to need is some self-rising flour, sugar, and a can of beer. So in a mixing bowl, I have three cups of the self-rising flour, and then I'm going to add a half of a cup of sugar, and then I have a 16 ounce beer that I'm going to add. First, I'm gonna stir my sugar and flour together. All right, then just pour in the beer. Then just give this a good stir until it's all combined. After you have mixed it together really well, then you're going to pour it into a loaf pan. Uh, this is my silicone loaf pan. I love this one because you don't have to spray it or anything and it comes out uh, really nice. Uh, it's about time for me to get a new one though. This one is looking pretty rough. I've used it a lot. Okay, so I have spread my dough out nice and even, and now I'm going to bake this in a 375 degree oven for about 40 minutes, uh, or until you can do a toothpick test and the toothpick comes out clean. I think it's done. And of course I've got to lather some butter all over the top as soon as it comes out of the oven. Just look at this beautiful bread. But now I've got to cut into it. All right, here goes. Just look at this bread. Oh, it's so beautiful. And there is nothing like some homemade strawberry jam to put on your bread. That is what I am talking about. Mmm hard to believe that with just three ingredients you can have a bread like this. It's so good. The first time I ever had beer bread was my mother-in-law had made it and it has become a family favorite. She makes it a lot uh, for different uh, family gatherings. It is so, so tasty. Okay, well I really do hope that you give this a try. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a fantastic day. And as always, I will see you soon with more recipes.